So if you remember, I don't like shopping. But I had a major problem. I hated spending time shopping and I hated the idea of buying something, spending a lot of money on like updating your wardrobe and then a couple years later having to like re-update your wardrobe because uh, uh, why was there a black pause in the middle of that clip? Oh crap, I must have made a mistake on the editing. <gasps> Anyway, there are three things in particular that make my shopping experience really, really annoying. First off is there's multiple prices for the same item. When you do a Google search for a specific item, there are a lot of results that come back. There's all these different vendors that sell them at all these different prices. One of the biggest things that I hate about shopping is the time that it takes to just find the item for a good price. You go from store to store, you go from website to website, and in my own experience, believe it or not, Amazon doesn't always have the best price. <gasps> what? Amazon doesn't always have the best price? It's true. Some websites include tax, some websites don't include tax. Some websites include shipping, some websites don't include shipping. Sometimes websites have sales and you think that that's actually helping you, but then their shipping and handling fee is like insane. The worst part about this is that you usually find out at checkout which is after you've already put in all your shipping information and given all your information to another company, it's just gonna use it to send you more spam emails. The second thing is trying to find the best price. So I was raised by my mom who immigrated from China and she didn't come here with much money. So she did the logical thing, which was to always buy stuff on sale. Now. I've also kind of adopted this when I go shopping for things, which obviously makes the selection a little bit more limited, but people are always putting things on sale, so I can get by pretty well. But the thing that annoys me the most is when you're waiting for an item to go on sale, or you think that an item is gonna go on sale, and you wait and you wait and you wait, and then it does go on sale. So then you say, yes, I can go buy this item, and I got a good, good deal, I got it on sale, I'm happy. But the thing that really pisses me off is when that item goes on sale like maybe the next week and it's even cheaper. <sighs> and the process to get that price is like usually not worth it. Usually they won't even give it to you. And if you're really trying to go through all the hassle, you can return it and then buy it for this new price. But that's just such a hassle. But all of that stems from the fact that there's an anxiety with trying to get the best price. So that anxiety is what I hate. Could I get it for cheaper? If I wait just a couple more months, will I be able to get a better deal on it? Maybe that's just an Andy thing, but that really annoys me when I buy something that's on sale and then it goes on sale for even more later. <sighs> that really makes me mad. Third thing is the pricing game. As you may have noticed, a lot of stores put prices like $24.99 or $19.99. And the reason why they do that is to take one cent off so that it looks like it's a whole dollar cheap. Like, oh, it's 19 instead of 20 when really it's just one cent cheaper. Or subconsciously you say, oh, $24.99 is closer to 20. Or it's like, you know, 24 rounds to, to 20 instead of like 30. Sometimes they even do it to rank higher on the search optimization. So when you try and filter by lowest price first, this item pops up. But then they hit you with all these different fees. All of these are strategies that these companies use. But I've got a solution for you. Introducing the obvious price. What is the obvious price you ask? Well, simply put, what you see is what you get. It should be obvious. That's why it's called the obvious price. But Andy, how will I know that this is the best price and that we can't get a better price elsewhere? Silly viewer. We're not planning to have sales at the obvious company. What? We've done the calculations to make sure that our products are the most affordable. So as we grow and develop, we're going to reinvest the profit and reinvest it in a way that allows us to get even better products for the best possible price. And obviously, we're gonna pass that price to you. So you can rest assured that right now is the best time to buy anything from the obvious company. You don't need to wait till Christmas to get a big discount because we've already factored in the discount. So the price stays even the whole year. No more waiting, and no more searching. You're gonna find the products that you love at theobviouscompany.com for the best price, the obvious price. One thing that we're gonna do to spice it up is that we're gonna add free limited edition items because 
who doesn't like free stuff and who doesn't like limited edition stuff so you're gonna be paying the obvious price but you're gonna be getting even more stuff on top of that but andy what about shipping and tax we built standard shipping in the U.S. and tax into the obvious price. No more trying to figure out what my end total is. All you gotta do is add the prices that you see and, well, that's what you're gonna get. But Andy, are you gonna manipulate the prices so that you can trick us into buying more things? <sighs> Does that sound obvious to you? <clears throat> I also forgot how much joy it brings me to see the final price end to a round zero cent number. No games. What you see is what you get. It's just a simple price. It's just the obvious price. I think that'll be really good. Let me know in the comment sections below what you hate about shopping and maybe we'll implement those things into the obvious company as well. We're always looking for ways to make your shopping experience better and more enjoyable. Also, if you like this pocket tee, make sure you check out theobviouscompany.com to get yours because it's super limited quantity and it might not be in the store for very much longer. So. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.